Hey everybody, welcome to the Outer Rim Rookie of Beginner's Journey to joining the 501st and Rebel Legion. My name is Rob Williams. Oh boy, these next two days are going to be busy days. Today is October 30th, the day before Halloween, and I've got a troop downtown at the train station. I'm going to be picking up Jamie, my co-host of the Generation X Wing podcast, and our local Obi-Wan Kenobi. Hello there. And we are going to have a great time, but... Today's vlog is not just about the troop today. It's actually about today and tomorrow. Since it is Halloween tomorrow, I'm going to be wearing my Scout Trooper costume for three events. Well, I call them events. One, the troop today. Two, wearing it to school tomorrow. And three, I'm wearing it for trick-or-treating <laughs> that same night. So I, I'm going to be in this costume for total of... Gosh, it's going to be a long time. It's like a six, seven hour day at school, plus maybe an hour or two an hour and a half at the troop, plus probably an hour and a half. Wow, wow. The math teacher just realized he's gonna be in this costume for a long time, <laughs> but it's gonna be fun. One of those special times, I'm not a huge Halloween fan. I've always had problems finding costumes for Halloween, but now I've got the, the best costume in the world. They got two of them working on a third. It's great having a costume handy and you don't have to put a lot of thought into it. So this vlog today is gonna to be about my next 48 hours of scouting in the wild. That thing's gonna to need to be washed at the end. Oh my goodness. So uh, first things first, let's get my coins together just in case somebody wants to trade coins. So here's some of the coins. I was just putting some in a bag just now, but I've got a whole bunch more. Look at all this. So I've got, I'm just sifting through ones that I think people would want or you know, ones that people would want to trade for and just seeing if anybody's interested. We don't do a lot of coin trading up here. So it's nice to do some coin trading online, but who knows, maybe. Some will want one of these lovely little coins. All right, let's get this together, pack up our bags, and hit the road. By the way, quick update. I was able to find a coin that has been very, very hard to find. It's my uh, the Outer Rim Squad coin. I'm super excited I got that. I got the 100th member coin. These are two coins that I've been looking for for a long time and I was able to finally get it. So thank you to the mysterious trader who will remain anonymous, but I really appreciate that. Super excited. I don't have a coin problem, you have a coin problem. I'm totally fine, everything's great. By the way, Jamie's gonna be super excited today when I pick him up when he sees my selfie stick. Look, there we go. Huh? Look at the selfie stick. Jamie loves a selfie stick. He loves a selfie stick. So he's going to be so excited to see me rolling up with this bad boy right here. Huh? <laughs> I can already hear him swearing at me. Some traditions a lot of people have when going to a troop is what they wear. And today I'm wearing my typical BDU, as you can see right here. It's this nice little collared shirt. Have my patches. Dark set on the right side. Good set on the left. And for the shirt today, I'm wearing my Outer Rim Rookie shirt, which is no longer for sale on Tee Public due to copyright problems. Sorry, no, didn't mean to steal, sorry. Also, just wanted to add, I got a new belt. This one is from Walt's Trooper Factory. We'll be doing a video on this, putting this together and comparing it to the old belt, which I got from Studio Creations. So it's gonna be a belt comparison. These two belts are very different. Uh, if you take a good close look at them. So stay tuned for that video. Last day, uh, my last troop, I forgot my balaclava and I was balaclavaless. I think that's a word. It looks very strange when you don't have a balaclava, especially with my helmet, which is a little bit shorter than I wanted to, so you can kind of see your chin. But fortunately, our man Darth Vader stepped up and gave me a balaclava to wear. In fact, it was the one I lent him for C4, so it all comes around. You know, the good stuff all comes around. So let's pack this stuff into the car and get going. All right, let's see what type of day it is. I don't have a good feeling about this. I'm not thrilled it's raining. Fortunately, we're inside, but tomorrow it's gonna be a wet day. Here he comes, all wet. He's all wet. Hello, sir. Good day. How's it going? Good, good. Are you influencing? I'm influencing right now. <laughs> Jamie, look what I got. Look what I got. Oh, jeez. Look what I got. It's a selfie stick. Of course we got It's a selfie stick. stick. 
Do you want to touch it? No, I don't touch want to touch it. 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 Okay, well, to make up for that, I'm going to get you this. I didn't, I didn't gift wrap it, sir. Or are we, are we I'm, I'm exchanging gifts. Happy birthday. Ooh. It's, a, it's a swear jar. I don't know anything about it. I know nothing about whiskey. I think it's whiskey. Is it whiskey? <laughs> Yes, yeah, I asked for whiskey. It said whiskey, so there you Brilliant. go. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Ron. And I you think you can actually keep it as a swear jar. I might do that. You have such a pot of mouth. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Ron. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Look at that. Cook <laughs> just came in. Simon came in just to give you a happy birthday wish. We're, we're, we're influencing. Happy birthday to whoever. <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> Oh, isn't that sweet? <laughs> what was that to answer? See, look at the light. Selfie. I'm a purist. I don't uh, use the selfie stick. <laughs> well. It's just our dumb faces. All right, we're back home. That was fun. That was a fun night. That was a really fun night. I had a great time. Uh, meeting so many kids at the Starlight Foundation, just goofing around with my friends. It was a great turnout. Tomorrow's Halloween. Gonna be at school dressed up as a scout again. By the way, real quick, the soldering job I did on the soundboard of my hand worked like a charm. It's fantastic, super excited. I'm gonna get to bed soon here and get ready for day two tomorrow, Halloween. Oh, having fun, it's fun. All right, later. Good morning, it is Halloween today and um, just got up the stairs lugging all the gear, getting changed right now, but this is my room. Uh, I've changed the back, no more superheroes. I want to change things up again. I do have Amazing Man out the front door right over there though. Oh, no, sorry, there he is. Put him up there, he kept falling off the door. <laughs> Can't forget my Amazing Man. Okay, let's get changed and start the day. 
There's very little I'm going to be able to show you here at school. This, this may be obvious for some and may be new for others, but uh, we have certain rules in school. Um, no sharing pictures of students. That's a pretty obvious one. No weapons in school. Now that even includes fake weapons and especially at Halloween. So my blaster, I'm even going to take my thermal detonator off. Technically it's a weapon. Technically nobody knows that. It's just it's easier if I just take the damn thing off. I can't, I can't sit down in my chair <laughs> with the damn thing on. It's going to be bad enough with this tank on. Yeah, so there's not going to be a lot to show you here at the school. Just trying to keep a lid on the pot some days. Uh, back. Uh, I've, I've been back hours now. I've actually, when I got home, I immediately went to the couch to nap and I was out for almost an hour or so just recouping. And then I just had dinner. So now I'm going to put the costume back on again <laughs> and meet my son and go trick or treating, which is going to be fun. Let's go. Let's do this. Let's do this. <laughs> we are back. It's a long night. Uh, would have been here sooner if I hadn't locked my keys in the car. <laughs> I got so distracted, I was changing, and um, as I was changing, I accidentally set off the alarm, and then kids saw me changing into my scout trooper costume. I got so distracted, closed the door, and the minute I closed the door, I realized I had locked my keys in my car. Anyways, I'm thankful that Scott's mom had was able to drive me back home, get my second set of keys, and then we had a fun night, though. Had a, had a fun night. It was good seeing Scott just kind of run around with his friends. All the cool... Star Wars stuff. Got a few people that uh, tried to Jedi mind trick me. That was kind of neat. Uh, these are not the droids you're looking for. These are not the candies you're looking for. <laughs> the Rebels were that way. <laughs> it was lots of fun. Lots of fun. And now I'm back home and I don't know if you can hear the fireworks going off in the distance, but that's the cue for the end of Halloween. Next episode, um, as much as I really want to work on the Rees costume, I can't do that right now. It's The, the time is just so packed of stuff. I just can't find a moment to sit down and actually figure out the sewing of it. But I should be able to work on my new Scout Trooper belt and do a little comparison of belts. Uh, might have to get some more armor stuff too because it's not only the Scout Trooper belt that's breaking down, but I think my chest plate's breaking down too. So might be doing that in the future too. The old Scout Trooper is getting pretty uh, worn out there. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe. Um, Thank you for everybody who has been subscribing and watching. Really appreciate the time you take in watching these videos. And I hope, uh, hope you enjoy a little look into just my Halloween 2022. So talk to you later. Bye.